Hey there, my name is Travis Albritton, head of content at Buzzsprout. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to get your podcast listed in Google Podcasts. So getting your podcast into Google Podcasts is a little bit of a different process than most of the other podcast directories. And that's because Google Podcasts does not have a manual submission process that you can go through where you say, here is my podcast, here are all the details, please take it. They don't do it that way. Instead, they use their web crawler to search the internet for podcasts. And if that podcast conforms to all of their guidelines for being listed as a result in Google search, then your podcast gets picked up and listed in Google Podcasts. But there are a couple things that you can do to speed up that process of Google discovering your podcast. And so I want to show you how to do that both with Buzzsprout and then if you also use a different podcast host, how you can still get your podcast listed in Google Podcasts. So if you use Buzzsprout to host your podcast, all you would do is go to Directories, and then over at Google Podcasts, click Get Listed. So here we just have a little blurb telling you that Google Podcasts is looking for your podcast, but there's no submission process. But what you can do is click this button down here to check and see if Google Podcasts has your podcast already listed. Okay, so it says here that our new podcast that we just created is not listed in Google Podcasts yet, but it could take a few weeks to find and index your podcast. Now, if you are on a paid Buzzsprout plan, then the website, the podcast website that we create for you includes all the code and optimization that is required by Google to get listed. So it's just a matter of time. Your podcast will get picked up by Google Podcasts. You don't have to worry about that. It does take a little while sometimes, but that's just the nature of Google Podcasts. Now, if you wanted to double check and see, say a week from now, is the podcast in Google Podcasts yet, then you can go to this website that Google's created called Podcast Preview. And I'll leave links to all of these websites below this video. So you can just click over and uh, do that. And so here what you can do is enter in your RSS feed URL into this field right here. And if your podcast is listed in Google Podcasts, then it will give you a link to your podcast in Google Podcasts. But if not, it'll say we can't find it. So I'm going to show you an example of a podcast that's not listed in Google Podcasts and an example of a podcast that is so you can see the difference. So since I know that PodTalk isn't listed yet, I'm going to go ahead and copy this RSS feed, go back to Podcast Preview, paste it in here, and then click this Generate button. So here you can see this RSS feed is not currently indexed by Google Podcasts, which we know, we already knew that, but let's try a different RSS feed, one that I know is in Google Podcasts, so you can see what that would look like. So I went ahead and copied and pasted in an RSS feed for how to start a podcast, which is already listed in Google Podcasts. So now when I click the Generate button, I get this message that says, hey, we have your podcast, and here is the URL if you want to share that podcast from Google Podcasts. And so this is the link that you would use if you're creating any custom buttons on your website or if you wanted to share your podcast with somebody that listens on an Android device. So this is a really quick way for you to check if your podcast has been picked up by Google Podcasts or not. Now, if you host with somebody else other than Buzzsprout, or if you have your podcast listed on your own website, let's say that you're using Amazon Web Services or WordPress or Squarespace to host your podcast, there is a way for you to initiate Google to crawl through your website. But first, you have to make sure that your RSS feed, that your website is searchable. So Google has a lot of criteria, a lot of guidelines on how to make sure that your podcast will get picked up. And so here you can see this is in their developer guide. Again, I'll leave a link to this website in the notes below this video so you can click over and click around. And specifically, you wanna make sure that you are following the podcast guidelines right here. And so here, Google's gonna tell you, this is what you have to do in order for your podcast to be featured and included in Google Podcasts. And again, if you use Buzzsprout, we take care of all this for you. You don't have to worry about any of this. But if you're hosting on your own website or if you're hosting with a podcast host that doesn't provide a website for you that is tailored for Google Podcasts, then you'll want to make sure that you are meeting all of these guidelines and criterias. But there's one more thing that you can do 
if you don't use Buzzsprout and you want to speed up the process of Google potentially finding your podcast. And that is to use PubSub Hubbub. I know it's a mouthful, but if you go to pubsubhubbub.appspot.com slash publish, you can manually submit a URL to Google to be crawled, to be searched, all right? So all you would do is paste your podcast RSS feed in the topic URL under publish and then click publish. Now, when you do this, nothing is going to happen, <laughs> okay? So don't expect like a, yay, you did it, pop up to show up because that's not really how this site works. But if you do that, click publish, that initiates Google to crawl the internet looking for that specific URL. And when it finds it, when it finds your podcast through this pub sub hubbub, then your podcast will get included in Google Podcasts. Hey, thank you so much for watching this channel. If you want to see more podcast videos like this one, click here to subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can also click up here to see one of our recent gear review videos, talk about microphones and things. And then also down here, we've got a software tutorial, teach you how to edit some stuff. Pretty useful skills if you're going to be making a podcast to know how to use microphones and how to edit stuff.